this is the first time that i'm vlogging really um i did like an update um kind of chit chat video um and then you know we had kind of like a catch-up vlog of stuff that i didn't get to post until hunter was here so you guys are basically all caught up i've spent the couple, past couple of days not worrying about vlogging trying to just get back into the groove of things today was the first day that i literally got ready um and part of it is because i just have to film like a review video today um but uh, mr hunter we're still kind of struggling at night it's still like that two hour period last night's was a little earlier there was like i think between 10 and like midnight we had a hard time getting him down and stuff um but after like we finally got him to calm down i just swaddled him and gave him a pacifier after like <laughs> i kept feeding him but the poor thing i think i overfed him and he like threw up and <sighs> it's been fun but once we got him down he literally slept till like 6 30 7 o'clock so um it worked out i'm still just stressed out like this week is easier because like i have two sets of hands like tj is here so if i'm getting ella ready like he'll watch him or vice versa um when it comes to next week when i'm on my own i'm just a little nervous so <laughs> so we're just you know we've been trying to settle in like get stuff situated um i've still been like nesting kind of like i've been like cleaning out like crazy like there's a whole bunch of boxes in the kitchen that's literally just like all trash that i just got rid of last night that needs to be put out so i've just been kind of like organizing and <sighs> that's it um tj today is a big like bathroom renovation day so tj is on his way back um and he's going to be working on the bathroom all day so i'm going to take mr hunter to his first like pediatrician checkup um since leaving the hospital so that's what we're going to go do i'm just about i gotta wake him up in just a minute to change him and then he ate three hours ago so he will probably want a bottle before we leave so I'm gonna do that right now. And then um, I might bring you guys like throughout the week, this vlog might be a little choppy where I just kind of like record here and there and put it all in one vlog instead of just going like one full day. Um, so we'll see, probably um, it'll just be kind of chopped together. So again, I gotta get him ready and fed. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. All right, little man, it's time to get ready. I hate bothering them when they're so peaceful. So we just finished our first appointment. We got a little bit of spit up over there. My boy is healthy and good to go. This is where your sister comes to. You did such a good job. So today we are gonna go out. Um, Hunter and I are heading out right now to go get his birth certificate. Um, and then I'm hoping to show you guys a little bit of the progress in the bathroom. TJ's, that's why he's not with me. He's only got a couple more days of his paternity leave. So he's upstairs today, um, finishing plumbing and then subflooring. He went out and picked some up last night. Um, so I'm super excited because that means that we're going to make like some serious, um, progress in this bathroom. And then as soon as that is done, Mr. Hunter's room is going to be worked on and honestly his room is so much easier than the bathroom so his will go super fast. Hopefully going to get his certificate is going to be quite straightforward um, but I do kind of got to go back up to where the hospital was so it's a little bit of a drive not bad. Plans have been changed. <laughs> I ended up driving all the way. Um, Today. Good, how are you? Pretty good. Thank you. Just so to change. Thank you so much. You too. I wish I... Oh, <laughs> I hit my damn ear. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I wish I told that girl I liked her nails. They were really, really pretty. Anyways, I drove all the way up to Town Hall. And then I realized that it's like, it's so hard to find. Good, how are you? Thank you, you too. Um, 
this particular town hall that I had to go to was really difficult to find. And then, like, I remember going there um, for Ella's certificate when she was born. And it's also, like, all street parking. Like, it's a city. It's nothing like Boston, but it's a bigger city. Oh, my goodness gracious. This is spilling. Um, so I was just, I was intimidated. I got there, and I called TJ, and I'm like, you know what? I said, I'm just going to wait until you can come with me because... A, I don't feel comfortable like walking around as a woman by myself in a city with a newborn not knowing where I am. So, um, yeah, that plan kind of got squashed. So, I've been in the car for an hour for real, no real reason, but I tried. We're just hanging out. Ella is currently playing with some friends she made at the mall. We're just hanging out after dinner. But I figured I'd show off this little stud muffin. Hi, Annie. She's been looking around so much. How are you? What are you doing, buddy? Oh, that was cute! <laughs> I'm just trying to wash him. I hope he's excited. Oh, you got it in your pee pee. I'm just trying to fix it. Man. I know, it's cold. You hate it. You hate me. You resent me. You plan on stealing my car when you're 18. I understand. Are you recording this? Ugh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I know. Just, just, just let me do this part. I'm usually done by now. I know how to. I'm not your mother. I'm not good at this. It's okay. As long as you don't cry. You're like these are already too small. Or just probably able to. Yeah, yeah. I eat the wrong. So Ella had a sleepover. She was dropped off at like 6.30. I'm on my way to go pick her up. So we have a like pancake palooza thing today at her school. So it's like breakfast for her school and stuff. So we're gonna go do that. And then I think today my mom wanted to take us to do a little bit of shopping for Hunter. So we're gonna do that. And then I have a date night with my girls. Today is a super duper busy day. Ella, where are we at today? We're at our school doing a like, pancake palooza thing. Yeah. What are you gonna get? Pancakes. Pancakes? <laughs> Mr. Hunter's <laughs> with us today. Somebody is yelling at me to change him. Hi, Andy. I'm just getting him changed real quick. We're gonna get a bottle, right? Let's do this real quick. Uh, excuse me, don't scratch my couch, please. Talking to the cat. Oh, honey. This is like his least favorite thing is being changed. <laughs> but we got it. We've been getting better. You used to yell at me every time I changed you. Now you yell at me when I'm taking too long. I don't even know if you guys can hear him grunting at me. Excuse me. Excuse me. You just lost your pants and your socks. You just lost your pants and your socks. And you know what that means? Now it's going to take me even longer to get you ready. It wasn't my fault. It wasn't my fault. You're, now you're pushing off the other one. Oh my goodness. Boy. Boy. Come here. You're gnawing on that glove. Oh my goodness. Okay, come here. We're all done. We're all done. Yay! <laughs> Terrible angle, I'm well aware. <laughs> Come here. Come on. Let's get you set up and then I'll get my camera set up. How about that? Come on. There we go. Oh, that's the good stuff. So we just got back from um, doing a little bit of shopping. Actually, I don't have Ella with me <laughs> because uh, I went after the pancake palooza thing we went to at Ella's school today. I picked up 
Amber and my mom with the kids and we did a little bit of shopping. You can see one of the bags here. Um, and then Ella asked my mom, cause I, so I'm going to my mom's tonight to drop off Hunter for just a couple hours so we can go rollerblading. So Ella's like, oh, can I stay with Mimi? So my mom was fine with this. She's like, if she wants to come with me and then when you drop Hunter off and pick her up, like you can switch the kids. So I'm like, I said, that's up to you. I said, I'm just going home. I said, I got some laundry. He's going to be hungry. You know, if you want to take her, then take her. So that's where she is right now. Um, but yeah, we did a little tiny bit of shopping. Hunter just needed a few things. Do you hear him? I got to show you guys this real quick. Oh. He makes the cutest noises. Oh, my little bum. We ended up getting, like I said, Hunter just needed a couple of things. So I picked him up some stuff. And then I had a Victoria's Secret gift card that I've had since Christmas I've been holding on to. But I just decided, I'm like, you know what? I'm not pregnant anymore. Like, I kind of feel a little bit better about my body. <laughs> I said, why don't I go get, like, oh, my gosh. It's so windy. My door, like, my screen door is slamming. Um, I said, why don't I go get some bottoms? So I'm not going to show like what I got at Victoria's Secret on camera, um, fam family friendly content, but I got like three bottom pieces. Um, but I will show you guys the baby stuff that I got. But as soon as you're done eating and I can burp you, we'll do that, huh? Oh, you're so content. He's been a good boy. He wakes up every th every about three hours but it's probably so it's probably like three times a night that I have to wake up with him usually he'll eat at like eight and then again at like 11 between 11 and midnight and then again at like four three or four in the morning and then the last time that he wakes up like we're up and ready for the day I actually asked my mom today I really want to get back into going to the gym as well. So I asked her like maybe on later mornings that TJ doesn't have to be at work until like seven. Maybe I can start going to the gym. And then I, I have to be home at seven anyways, especially on weekdays to get Ella to school. But if I can just like, I don't know, I want to get back into it. I feel good and I'm ready for that summer body. You know what I'm talking about? You don't have a clue. <laughs> I ended up scheduling. Hunter has a little photo shoot on Monday. What's the matter, baby? So I was kind of looking for outfits like that. But I also, um, I wanted to surprise TJ. Because TJ was actually just given his dad's baby blanket for Hunter. So I want to take the baby blanket to the photographer and get some pictures done with that too. But I'm not telling TJ until I get the photos and then I'll show him. Um, so I'm, I'm honestly assuming he's probably going to be naked for the majority of the time. Um, but we'll see. I also don't know if like JCPenney does the, those kind of newborns. It's different if you're working with like a private photographer. But I'm going to take some pictures of my own I think too. Um, but yeah, we're going to go get some nice photos done. So with that in mind, I did get a couple things. Oh no. Oh no. I left the bag in the car. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll show you what's in this bag, but there's another bag that's full of his clothes. If I can put him down in the bobby and he's actually like sleeping, we'll see. Sometimes he only does this if you're holding him. Okay, so I can show you guys though, but I needed some crib sheets. I have one set right now, so I picked up this pack of two. It's gray, and then there's like animals on the other one. Um, he had soaked through one of his diapers one night. He went like a six hour period of not waking up, and he soaked through and like got the sheets all dirty, and I only had one pair of sheets at the time, so I'm like, oh my gosh. So I learned my lesson. I went out today, got some extra sheets. I also got some hangers. Um, his room obviously is not done. He doesn't have a closet yet, but his clothes have been going into my room right now. So I just picked up some of these hangers that will follow him into his own room eventually. 
Um, and then I actually got two little things for myself. I wasn't going in to spend any money on myself, but then I saw these and they were really cute. Um, I'm actually going to be filming a haul pretty soon of like clothing that I've collected over the nine months that I was pregnant. So I couldn't wear them at the time, but you know, I still bought them cause I thought they were cute. So, um, you're not going to be able to see these very well, but this will be in the haul and the next piece will be in the haul if you actually want to see them on, but it's just a strappy, uh, uh, it's, um, off the shoulder, like button down, really, really stretchy kind of fabric. Um, and then I also got this because I have two kids now, so I'm juggling a lot. So I wanted something that was comfortable, but still really, really cute. Um, it's kind of like, I thought it was a romper at first. What is that? I don't know what that It looked like he was laughing. I know he's not, but that's exactly what it looked like. Hi, babe. You laughing? Um, it's super breathable. I love the color like i like that it's white and then i like the kind of corally flowers on it but it's not a romper um it is a dress i don't know this is impossible to show you guys so you're gonna just have to check out that haul whenever i get around to filming and posting that maybe after the gym starts what handsomes what handsomes do you want to top off the bottle are you not done Oh, okay. We're not done. But that's fine, to be honest with you. The, I only got... Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. Let me grab this real quick. I promise I'll give it right back to you. I promise. The last thing that I got in this bag is just some more pacifiers. And they're like the zero to six month pacifiers. Um, I was using other ones. He didn't care for them as much, to be honest. Because Ella was never a pacifier baby, like I know babies don't need them. Um, so I'm trying to like keep, you're making a whole bunch of noise, aren't you? I'm trying to keep him off of pacifiers and I kind of use it as like a last minute resort kind of thing. Like if at night I just feed him, I just change him, I'm holding him for a while and then like he seems to fall asleep like he just did and then I'll put him in his crib and he starts crying, then I'll, I'll try to use a pacifier and it, it works some of the time. But you can tell when he really doesn't want him either. Are you looking at me? Hi, my handsome. You're opening your eyes a lot more. Are you okay? You okay? You okay? I feel you, bud. Hi, my handsome. So, once I find a moment to get my hands free, I will show you guys the rest of the stuff that we got because it's super duper cute. What's the matter, honey? What, Peppa? Doesn't really look like you want to eat anymore, but we got the new outfit on. Little tiny bit big. Oh, my honey. Oh, what's that face? It's not an up a storm, honey. Your nose is clear. Hi, babe. You're so handsome. <laughs> Hi. I love seeing those blue eyes. I love seeing those blue, blue eyes. I do. Oh, we're nice and awake now. I'm just trying to move you guys away from the window a little bit. I did change because um, I wanted to wear something. It's my first day back in skinny jeans <laughs> since being pregnant. I don't know how I feel about it. I'm not quite as like I still got some baby belly left but whatever anyways moving on um so this bag this is a second bag oh my flowers are kind of in the way and a burp cloth um this bag is full of hunter stuff so I'll show you guys a couple of the items that we got sorry I'm stepping on a whole bunch of stuff too so the first item this was just a bunch of clothing so I got him another pair of, <laughs> I got him another pair of pajamas because I needed something. I have like kind of fleecy pajamas, but our room is so warm that they're a little too hot. So I got him these. I liked them because they were A, a zipper, and then they had like the little built-in mittens, which is just amazing. So we got one of those. 
Um, oh, Ella has some clothes in here too. She picked out, this is for the spring, but she picked out this dress and then this little jacket which comes with it, which is super cute because it has the daisies on it too. And it has like some ruffles, really, really feminine, really cute. I love the color yellow on her. So she got that too. And then she also got this, but this is for the cruise in October this year but it's a little nautical outfit. So it comes with a white jacket. The jacket has an anchor on the back. And then the dress is all like, it has to do with all sailing. It has like buoys and anchors and like steering wheels for sailboats and stuff like that. So that's a little bit big, but that'll fit, fit her in October. And then she picked out her Easter dress and I am going to, so she's like kind of all set. Obviously I'm gonna make sure she has tights and shoes and an accessory to wear with the dress but hunter i'm gonna wait on until like early early april um will go and i'll pick him up something just because i don't know how big he's gonna be so i was gonna wait on him so ella picked out this little ivory ivory dress oh she has accessories in here too she picked out this ivory dress so it's all like laced up here has this silver like beading on the front it has like a satin bow in the back um but it's super cute and every year for christmas and easter we have her go and like we'll pick out like three to five different dresses for her to pick from and then she'll pick her favorites out of that and so this was this one this year maybe i can find a really cute set of bunny ears to go with this either silver ones or this like ivory color. Oh no, it's actually, you know what? In the sun, it almost looks like a really pale yellow. It's from the brand American Princess. I don't know, but it's, it's very, very, very beautiful. And then um, more of Hunter's clothes. I got him this set. It's like a dinosaur set. Um, I loved the pants because <laughs> they have like little scales on the side. But it comes with the short sleeve and it comes with the long sleeve once again with the built-in mittens. Then I got um, this little tractor set. So it says Mommy Digs Me. Again, it comes with one long sleeve with built-in um, mittens. And then it comes with a short sleeve too. And then it comes with the little pants with the little tractor on the front. Um, not a tractor, a, like a crane. And then the yellow shirt as well has all cranes and like construction vehicles. And, oh, I got him, this is just two pairs of pants. Um, I figured you can't go wrong with these because sometimes they'll pee through their diapers or something. So I always like just having extra pants too. And then we got um, this set as well. So it has, um, it's kind of like pajamas, but not really, because it doesn't have the footy pajamas, so I would put him in this on like a really lazy day, but I still have to run out. Run out. Um, same same kind of deal here, where it's like similar to pajamas, but not really, no footies. Um, they just button up where the diaper area is. So um, this one has a zipper, but the other one just buttons up, so. Um, I don't want to go crazy. With, I, I could spend so much more money buying newborn stuff, but they only wear it for so long. Um, and then Ella also got this dress. Her Mimi was there, okay? So she spoiled this kid, but she got this dress. Um, and it has, like, unicorns. And then it has, like, you know those sequins that, like, change color when you flip it up or flip it down. But it has a big heart in the, in the center. And then, like, all these kind of metallic um unicorns all over it so she got that and then the last thing she actually got two other accessories she got she's wearing it right now but it's in her hair it's like this little like elastic braid kind of thing and then she got like a little puppy pocketbook and then she also picked out um i think these are elastics too but they're all like just a little butterflies so yeah that's everything that we got so I'm going to go put this stuff away. I only have about an hour before we're going to head out. Um, and I'm hoping to get some footage while I'm at the skate park because I think that would be a lot of fun. I haven't been on rollerblades in forever. Like I'm going to be so sore after today, but it's okay. And it's totally worth it. <laughs>